G'day everyone, Viv here. I hope you're all keeping well. Welcome back. Kind of a useless video for you today. I wanted some bookmarks. I'm tired of using bloody hair ties or bits of Lego or some other sort of rubbish off my daughter's floor when I read her books at night. And I'm reading her The Hobbit right now, so I thought I'd make some bookmarks. First place to start is with a laminator. Now, most people don't have them laying around their house, neither do I. So I went to work and while no one was around, I quickly stole a laminator and brought it home. I will probably return it at some stage, but there we go. Um, these are Lord of the Rings battle games in Middle Earth uh, that Games Workshop released uh, 20 years or so ago are full of great pictures. Now I've got a load of spares of these duplicates that I just don't need so I'm going to cut a bunch of them up. They're obviously uh, heavily based around the game so there's lots of pictures and scenarios and all that sort of stuff but I'm specifically looking for pictures uh, of the characters out of the movie. Um, and then those I'll cut out of these magazines and uh, you know I'll cut out the image of the character, cut out another piece of interesting artwork and glue the two pieces together and uh, pop them through a laminator. You know, that's about it. You know, I'm going to use this map here. This is a great little piece of artwork to put on the back uh, side of the bookmark. Obviously, as you can see, Elrond there on the table, on the back of that piece of paper, on the back of that artwork will be you know, the, the next page of the magazine, which you know, I don't really want on there. So I'm going to put this map on the back of my bookmarks just so you know it looks neat and tidy. I'm just using a little bit of this glue. I'm not, you know, gluing the pieces together. This is just to tack it together so that the two pieces of uh, of magazine paper don't move when I trim them out in a minute. Um, and then, you know, trimming them off like this, you know, I'll get a nice clean border and, you know, there won't be, you know, the pages, you know, showing through if that kind of makes sense i'll just trim them all off make them all neat put them in my stolen laminator from the office and uh you know bob's your uncle there we go we've got a whole bunch of themed uh, uh what are they called bookmarks which you know i can use and i can lose and i can make many many more of them uh, and you could do this with anything you know i might get some uh, old white dwarf magazines and find some cool pictures of some 40k figures or whatever this thing takes ages to heat up go machine um, but you could do this for any, uh, you know, anything really, any sort of artwork that you want or imagery or pictures or whatever, make yourself a whole bunch of bookmarks to, uh, you know, so you don't have to use hair ties or bits of rubbish or a lollipop wrapper um, or God forbid a piece of Lego. Um, you know, I, my daughter, like many young children, collects rocks and she uses rocks as her bookmarks. Well, now she can have some cool bookmarks for... Uh, the different sorts of books that she's got there on her shelf and uh, you know there we go fun times congratulations everybody you've made yourself some bookmarks nice and simple kind of a pointless video you know but there we go I'm looking forward to uh, you know jumping into 2021 uh, you, know, you know as you can see things are slowly moving around and getting done here in my uh, uh, games room at home um, I can't wait to get where is it that thing hooked back up again so I can get more battle reports filmed. That's my overhead camera up there, which as you can see, well, I was currently not connected. Um, anyway, there we go. I'm rambling, I'm tired, it's three o'clock in the morning and I'm making videos about bookmarks. If you made it this far, congratulations. Go find something better to do. <laughs> I'll catch you later, see ya.